is to stir. To be valiant is to stand. Therefore, if thou art moved, thou runst away. The dog of that house shall move me to stand. I will take the wall of any man or maid of Montague's. The quarrel is between us, our masters, and us, their men. True. Yes. But I shall prove myself a tyrant. <laughs> and after I have fought with the men, I shall be cruel to the maids and cut off their heads. Well, the heads of the maids? Aye, the heads of the maids oh. or their maiden heads. Oh. Take it in what sense, though. Aye, they must take it in sense that feel it. <laughs> Aye, they shall feel while I am able to stand. And tis well known I am a pretty piece of flesh. Well, tis well thou art not fish. If thou hadst, thou hadst been poor John. <laughs> oh, draw thy tool. Here come two from the house of the Montagues. My naked weapon is out. Quarrel, I will back thee. How, turn thy back and run? Fear me not. Mary, I fear thee. Let us take the law of our side. Ooh. Let them begin. Ooh. I will frown. <laughs> As they pass by, let them take it as they dare. Nay, live. as they dare, I will bite my thumb at oh. them, which is a disgrace to them if they bear it. <laughs> do you bite your thumb at us, sir? I do bite my thumb, sir. Do you bite your thumb at us, sir? Is the law of our side if I say I? No, no, I do not bite my thumb at you, sir. But I do bite my thumb, sir. <laughs> do you quarrel, sir? Quarrel, sir? No, sir. If you do, sir, I am for you. I serve as good a man as you. No better. Well, sir. Say better. Here comes one of my master's kinsmen. Uh, yes. Better, sir. Oh, you lie. Draw if you be men. Gregory, remember thy swashing blow. Art fools, put up your swords. You know not what you do. What? Art thou drawn among these heartless hinds? Benvolio, look upon thy death. I do but keep the peace. Put up thy sword, a man to depart these men with me. What? Drawn thou talk of peace? I hate the word. As I hate hell, all Montagues at thee. Have at thee, coward! tempered weapons to the ground. And hear the sentence of your moved prince. Three civil brawls, bred of an airy word by thee, old Capulet, and Montague, yes, sir. have thrice disturbed the quiet of our streets. If ever you disturb our streets again, your lives will pay the forfeit of the peace. For this time, all others depart. Away! Capulet, you shall go along with me. Montague, come you this afternoon to hear our further pleasure in this case. Once more, on pain of death, all men depart! 